The flashlight can illuminate any situation. But the first version, invented in the late 19th century, wasn't all that efficient. It produced only flashes of light, so it was named flashlight. This invention soon proved to be more than just a flash, but the name stuck. The flashlight shows us the way when things look dim. To make a military flashlight, they place an aluminum bar in a computerized lathe. Blades go to work and shape it into a flashlight body. As a drill hollows out the bar, coolant flushes over it to prevent the metal from expanding as the tooling heats things up. This blade cuts threads on the outside so they can screw on a lens cap later. A gripper now pulls out the tube so tools can work on the back half. A blade slims that section down and then carves a cross weave onto it. This heavy texture will make the flashlight easier to grip. Next, they drill a hole in the flashlight's tail stud. It's an attachment for the wrist strap. After the flashlight body has taken shape, they give it a black protective coating. Next, using tons of force, a machine injects hot plastic into a mold which forms the lens for the flashlight. They place the lens in a jig and unscrew the mold core. The core has formed threads in the lens so it can be screwed onto the flashlight body later. They use another injection mold to make plastic flashlight bodies. The plastic flashlights are for more general use than the aluminum ones. For custom orders, they stamp a logo onto the flashlight using a hot foil press. Next, they insert light-emitting diodes into a circuit board. The diodes are electronic lamps that are very bright and can be used instead of traditional incandescent bulbs. They solder the diode's lead wires to a circuit board and then trim them with snippers. The diodes are now secured and connected to the circuit board. For bigger flashlights, they use a lot of diodes. Up to 60 of them for this flashlight that's being made for search and rescue work. Next, a stamping press shapes the bronze battery contacts. An ultrasonic welder bonds them to a plastic plate. Then they solder a wire from the diodes to the contacts. The lamp part of the flashlight is now built. Now they insert springs into the aluminum flashlight bodies. They load the batteries and the springs hold them in place. They slide the lamp assembly into the flashlight cavity and screw the lens on. This aluminum flashlight has just been put together in a flash. They move on to the plastic flashlights. The battery contact and spring assembly goes in, followed by the batteries. The light emitting diode lamp is next. They screw the lens onto the lamp. The plastic glare shield is the final touch. And now these flashlights are ready to shine.